Welcome back everybody. Hot Wheels Hilarity Season 9 is going to be in full swing at the very moment. What we got here is one of the several sets that I basically showcased for a brief moment in the last episode. This is essentially the multi-lane speed box that we're going to do first before we get to some of the others that I've also managed to pick up. Of course this comes with its very own blue tea gray, but I've also brought along this. A small handful of certain models that I'm basically going to be using to test out this product. But, since it's a multi-lane speed box, we're going to do some fun with this exact set. But let's get to unboxing first. Alright, now everything is out, and basically, a quick overview here. We got the box itself, which is essentially a four-lane starting gate. Several pieces of track, both in the original orange as well as yellow, complete with an orange stripe down the center. We got four flipper pieces in four different colors, four connector pieces, as well as all 15 models that I plan on using for this presentation. This is, in fact, morally going to be a test of how this thing works. And now I have the lid itself for the starting gate, as we'll just refer to this, all set up. It's basically possible by usage of a clamp on the bottom, which can snugly secure it to any surface that you intend to use it on. So, that's a good feature there. But then we got ourselves a straight track along with a few of the flippers. Not all the tracks going to be used here. This is morally just going to be a test. Eventually, I will have a full episode of this whole thing in usage with a little competition thrown in just because. So, what we're going to do is simply put all 15 of these models down this ramp using this as a starting point. I could see this being a good substitute for the super six lane raceway that I revealed last season. So, without further ado, let's get started. Now, let's get started. Looks like everything works well. Well, it does seem that the 59 Corvette Stingray race car didn't do too well here. Maybe this is not supposed to work well with all models, but I'm sure that with the good majority of which, you could probably use this for whatever application you intend to use. A dual lane, triple lane, or even for its original intended use as a quad lane race system. So of course, I'd see this as a total win. Considering it doesn't come with very much, I'm surprised the box itself is pretty big. It could have come with more tracks and connector bits or anything of the sort that might be my only con of this set. But everything else is just good here. So, well, stick around for more of these unboxings and quick overviews that I'll eventually get to using full time on HWH.